around that. Well, we can say it officially now. We'll be watching the champions today. The title secured in the last match. What a terrific position to be in, Stuart. A big moment here, Derek. There it is. A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. Showing patience, looking for the equaliser. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. Defenders need to cover. And teammates to play it to. But dealt with efficiently. And a good-looking ball. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Well, going for power from there, but not worrying the goalkeeper in the slightest. Can they forge ahead? No, chance missed. And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Conte has lost the ball. Into the advanced position. Can he put them ahead? Vignadere! And a goal to delight the fans! Just what they were hoping for! Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Vinicius Jr. Lewandowski. This could be the equaliser. And it is the equaliser. Well, now, that could be a huge turning point in this game. They carry the momentum. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. Let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Lewandowski. Can he put it away? And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve. Well, here it is again, and the way they've been playing, that was always going to happen. They've certainly been piling on the pressure here. Diata. Fed over towards the back post. Well, it didn't really work the keeper when all was said and done. Well, news coming through of a penalty in one of the other matches, and Alex Scott can fill us in. Yeah, it was a penalty for Montpellier, and it's only good... And he scored not once, but twice. 
They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, here it is again. It's a wonderfully weighted ball over the top. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. And read perfectly by Otamendi. Conte must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. And over comes the corner. Not messing around with that clearance. Bernat. And the cross goes in. Superb stop. And he gobbles up the second chance. Disappointment for the keeper. No wonder he's asking questions of his defence. Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately, it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. Trying to deliver it accurately. And a goal! An end-to-end -end game! And they weren't behind for long! Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. And a goal update for you in the Bordeaux match. Alex Scott, as ever, has the details. It's another goal for Lille. They're pulled ahead by two with 68 minutes played. Thank you, Alex. Can he get them the lead? And that goes down as an effort that he's not going to be remembering fondly. Vinicius Jr. Here is Juan Bernat. Gay. Can he do it? Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. 